Hi, today we're going to troubleshoot some of the issues you might be having putting YouTube videos into your web pages. Between YouTube and Sitefinity, it's pretty easy, but here's a couple tricks to get you started. Let's begin with the basics. This will be the video we're going to try to embed. So, how do we do that? Go down to share, and you'll see we got three options share, embed, email. The one we want is embed. Click that and copy the code out of this box. Now we go back to Sitefinity. Open up the content block that we already put on the page. Go to HTML mode. Paste the code we copied in there. Save it. Preview. There you go. It's that simple. But what if we wanted things to be a little different? Maybe we want a different size. Let's go back to YouTube. Click on Show More, and you'll see we have some customizing options. So we could pick a different size. Maybe we wanted a custom size. Let's say we just want to embed a smaller version of the video. Go to 350 wide. YouTube calculates the height for us, keeps it in proportion. Then just go back. Copy the code from that same place we did the first one. Same process. Save. And there you go. That's all there is to it. I'm sure you've seen this before. You get to the end of a YouTube video and the suggestions pop up based on what you've just watched. You might not want to have that on videos on your website, so what do you do? Go back to YouTube, and we're going back down to the advanced settings. See this top one? Show suggested videos when the video finishes. We will uncheck that. Then go back up and grab the code from where we've gotten it before. Let's copy that out. Going back to Sitefinity, and we're just going to replace the code we pasted there a little bit ago with the new stuff. Let's preview this. And you'll see when you get to the end. The video just ends. There aren't any suggestions.